out there. Here's Anna Berry with our Time Saver Traffic Report. Good morning, Anna. Good morning, Otis. Good morning, everyone. It's just a really great ride out there if you're heading out this lovely Friday morning. Let's start off with a map of Long Island. No problems on the LIE, the Northern State, the Southern State, and Sagda Coast. They're all off to a great start. Well, if you are headed to the airports this morning, then no need to worry because all flights are on or close to schedule at Kennedy, LaGuardia, and Newark. Good morning, Liberty. everyone. I'm Anna Berry in for Katie McGee. It's been a quiet ride out there on the roads this morning, starting off with a lovely shot of the Tappan Zee. Nice ride for you across the span. I think everyone's at home all cozy with their families. But let's check out the roads in New Jersey. As we can see here, it's a nice and easy ride on 7-8 in Summit. And I'm just so glad I get to give such good news because there's no traffic accidents out there on the road. Let's start off on the island. Unfortunately, we do have an accident in Brooklyn on the BQE, but we have Jim Smith with Chopper 2 HD checking it out. What's going on, Jim? The earlier Chopper 2 HD was over the cross. Bronx, where on the westbound side, we have icy conditions and spin-outs on the ramp to the Major Deacon. Good morning, everyone. I'm Anna Berry, and for Katie McGee, let's start off by telling you about some delays on Metro North. We do have an issue to tell you about this morning. We have some flooding in Westchester County. Good morning, everyone. I'm Anna Berry, and for Katie McGee, we still have the accident in the Bronx to inform you about. Eastbound Bruckner, just after 138th Street, we have a tractor trailer with a fuel spill blocking two lanes. And alternate side parking is in effect today. Otis, have a great New Year. Yeah, ring it in nicely. Our next new newscast is at noon and we're always on at cbsnewyork.com.